Orenco Systems is celebrating 40 years in business. We'd love to share some of the highlights of our story. It all begins in the 1970s when a friendship develops between Hal Ball and Terry Bounds. Hal's an engineer who loves his work, so naturally he encourages Terry to also become an engineer. Soon, the two of them are working on solutions for the on-site wastewater crisis that's developed in Douglas County, Oregon. When they find that the equipment they need isn't commercially available, they start designing and building it themselves, which leads to the founding of Orenco Systems. In 1981, Orenco launches its first products, the dosing siphon and the screened pump vault. The pump vault allows for the placement of pumps in septic tanks and improves the quality of effluent going into drain fields. This year also marks the beginning of more than a decade of work on sand filter technology, which becomes the company's first wastewater treatment system and leads to the development of Advantex Treatment Systems, one of our flagship products. Just three years later, in 1984, Orenco receives the first of many patents. Not surprisingly, this patent is for the screened pump vault, the cornerstone of our product line. The year's now 1987, and a Saturday morning's cold call to an engineer in Spokane, Washington, leads to the redesign of the Diamond Lake sewer system. With over 500 connections, it becomes Orenco's first large community treatment system. Also this year, Orenco reaches 1 million in sales revenues after taxes and expenses. All of it is reinvested in the company. By 1988, various buildings on Hal's property in Melrose have been converted into manufacturing space, including chicken coops and a tennis court. Hal and Terry are able to give up their day jobs to manage Orenco full time and the effluent filter is launched. By 1991, Orenco is ready to expand buying part of the Old Sutherland Airport and converting a hangar into a control panel shop. A few years later, in 1994, the sales, engineering, and management staff are excited to move into a new office building at the Sutherland location. And the first corporate logo is created. In 1998, Orenco launches the MVP control panel. We also begin researching and testing lightweight synthetic media for packed bed filters. Another sign of growth is Orenco now has a toll-free phone number. The very next year, we create our first website. We also put in place a system for tracking and controlling our growing number of documents, from case studies to instruction manuals. The year 2001 marks the launch of both the Advantex AX20 wastewater treatment series and the Vericom monitoring system. And in 2002, we follow up with the launch of the Advantex AX100 treatment systems. Orenco begins using the vacuum infusion molding process. This process, along with our extensive research and development, leads to the manufacture of the company's largest products, including AX Max treatment systems, T Max tanks, DuraFiber buildings, and composite covers. In 2006, Orenco moves its resin transfer molding operations to the Sutherland facility and implements lean manufacturing. With more than 200 employees, Orenco is named by the Portland Business Journal as one of Oregon's top 100 fastest growing companies. Three years later in 2009, we're ready to take on social media with the creation of the Orenco YouTube channel and Facebook page and the company continues to expand by purchasing a second manufacturing facility in nearby Winchester. Also in 2009, we launched the Advantex AX Mobile Wastewater Treatment System, followed the very next year by the AX Max and the AXRT. In 2011, our ongoing focus on workplace safety pays off when Orenco's tooling department wins the Governor's Occupational Safety and Health Award for ergonomic improvements in production. We also celebrate when our Advantex technology wins the Water Environment Federation's Innovative Technology Award. The Orenco product line continues to expand in 2012 as we introduce DuraFiber buildings and T-Max tanks. One of our crowning achievements takes place in 2013 when Orenco completes Oregon OSHA's Safety and Health Achievement Recognition Program, a five-year long effort. In 2014, we begin our popular webinar trainings, which now cover over 25 topics. More expansion takes place in 2015 when Orenco leases the North Bank Road facility in Wilbur. 
Also this year, we launched our solid fiberglass DuraFiber lid. The year 2019 is another big year for new products as we launch both the ClickTight Controls Package and the Prelos Wastewater Collection System. We also receive our latest patent for the Prelos Processor. We now have a workforce of almost 400 people, from the most recent new hire to those who have been with us for over 30 years. So here we are in 2021, celebrating 40 years in business. Company founder Hal Ball has recently retired from day-to-day -day operations, and co-founder Terry Bounds is serving as the chairman of Orenco's board of directors. Hal's two sons and two of Terry's children are in senior leadership positions. And the company now has three separate divisions, Orenco Water, Orenco Controls, and Orenco Composites, each with its own focus, but still working together and complementing one another. Here's to another 40 years of protecting the world's water.